Hello everyone, it's Lisa here, uh, chiropractor at Errol Street Chiropractic and today we are talking cervical denerol. When do we prescribe the cervical denerol? How do we know when someone needs this device? So this is a home traction device primarily used to help to increase the curve in the neck and to increase flexibility there as well. Now, uh, the normal curve in the neck should be a 40 degree forward curve. Now, if there's a significant loss of that curve, then we may prescribe the general. Now, it's not just the loss of curve that will warrant the use of one of these. There are other factors as well. Uh, we look at degeneration of the spine, curves, the symptoms. We also look at a particular angle that is specific for each person, whether we're able to reach and improve that curve close to 40 degrees, that is called the PT. TSIA, the post-tangential sternal angle of incidence. We also look at the rest of the body. It's all connected. If there's too much curve in that mid-back, that will also prevent us from using the general. We need to sort out that mid-back curve and then work on that neck curve. So there are several things that is important for you to you know, make sure your general is prescribed by a chiropractic biophysics practitioner, someone who's had quite a bit of training and experience in working with this. Obviously, you can see there's different colors, there's different sizes. We also need to learn through X-ray where exactly to place the apex, that uh, bump there of the curve to really influence that curve. We find that the general also works really well with people people's symptoms so it helps to improve things like neck ache, stiffness, pains down the arm, radiculopathy, um, sometimes even things like dizziness. So um, you know it does help with a lot of symptoms if you fit the criteria. So it is also a part, the Denerol use, um, it's part of a multimodal program. It's, it's a, the CBP protocol includes the Denerol to improve the curve. But what we find is when there are areas of curve loss, there's also quite a bit of stiffness in those joints. So then we do adjust those areas. We also do some neuromuscular rehab exercises. The muscles after a while, if the neck curve has been sitting in the wrong position, will change in length and they will change in the way that they're functioning. So we do need to rehab those exercises as well. So it is a part of a plan. So if you have any questions around the Denerol, uh, you're not sure about anything, then please feel, feel free to reach out, call us, message me, and we are more than happy to help you here at Errol Street Cairo. Thanks everyone. Bye for now.